For centuries, when we looked up into the night sky, we believed we were seeing the entirety of the universe, a scattering of stars across a dark canvas. Then came the telescope, and suddenly we realized that what we thought were single stars were actually entire galaxies. With the Hubble Deep Field in the 1990s, astronomers pointed a telescope at a patch of space no bigger than a grain of sand held at arm's length, and found thousands of galaxies hidden in that sliver of sky alone. That's when the realization hit. Our universe is teeming with galaxies. Today, estimates suggest there are over two trillion galaxies in the observable universe. Not millions, not billions, trillions. Each one a sprawling system of stars, planets, gas, dust, and dark matter. Some larger than our Milky Way, and others mere dwarfs, flickering on the edge of existence. But here's the astonishing truth. Most of these galaxies are so faint and distant, they remain invisible even to our most powerful telescopes. And that's where the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, comes in. A game changer for cosmic observation. With its infrared eyes, JWST peers deeper into space and further back in time than any instrument before it. It's revealing galaxies that form just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. Galaxies previously beyond the reach of human sight. Each image it sends back is rewriting our understanding of galactic formation and the sheer density of structure in the early universe. But this discovery isn't just about counting galaxies. It's about tracing the evolution of galaxies across time. How did the early chaotic clumps of gas and dark matter grow into the grand spirals and massive ellipticals we see today? How many galaxies have merged, collided, or been consumed by others? And are we still underestimating the true number of galaxies out there? Even the term observable universe is a limitation. Beyond the cosmic horizon lies a realm we can't yet touch. Not because it doesn't exist, but because light from those distant reaches hasn't had time to reach us. So the number two trillion isn't a final answer. It's a snapshot, constantly evolving with every new image, every deeper look, every starlight caught from the edge of time. In truth, the universe may be even more crowded than we dare imagine.